Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. So we're going to do a love reading. We're going to look at you and the person you're dealing with or whoever is on your mind. Could be a Cancer Pisces. Um, we're going to look at the past, the current energies, and then the immediate future outcome, their next move towards you. So uh, Taurus and the person that's on your mind, remember that the energies can always be reversed. And also remember it's just a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. Somebody may not have made a choice in the past or some type of decision, but it also feels like regardless, um, you know, things may kind of feel like they're at a standstill. Like they are moving just incredibly slow. Oh shit, things could have ended there. Could have been dealing with a fire sign. For some, this is this is already over, but it does look like there's some regret there. Like somebody's trying to figure out how to reach out or what to say but this may have taken the communication may it may have been a while all right so Taurus, for the past you got the king of cups could be dealing with the water sign what's the current energy please the four of pentacles well i mean they're still here if that was the case all right and what is the immediate future outcome or their next move towards Taurus. All right, well, uh, it's not as stable. For some, you may have a, a choice between uh, uh, an air sign and a water sign. It doesn't have to be that. But um, if not, if it's just one person, somebody's kind of strategically trying to figure out what to do. In the past, you had the King of Cups. So like I said, you could be dealing with a water sign. There what there there are feelings here. It kind of feels like this person's been more so observing or watching. The current energy is the four of pentacles. So somebody's still holding on to this, still wanting this, still, you know, it's something that's still kind of at play. So when the current energy, but somebody could still be very held back with that. So with the four of pentacles where that's kind of like a held, holding back yet holding on, the immediate future is the two of pentacles. So it's almost like that two the, the pinnacles at play, but for some things are still kind of like up in the air a little bit, or you may have a choice. Show me this uh, King of Cups for the past, please. The Six of Wands. Well, that's happy. This person made you very happy. That's an elated type feeling. Feeling of success. It may have kind of been like, yo, all eyes on you. You got the devil there, Capricorn energy. So for some, I mean, you could be dealing with a couple of things. Like whatever it was, it's been difficult to overcome because the love is there. Like this person definitely thinks very highly of you. But for some, it could be somebody was like uh, a drinker. It could also be like a best friend thing that turned into more. It could be um, sometimes that can be like a manipulative energy that... Um, <clears throat> It's kind of like it can be like get him refit in on their schedule. Or it, I mean, it doesn't have to go that deep. But with the devil, there's something that's kind of like on repeat here. Somebody is definitely holding on. Why is the devil there for the past? The four of swords. Yeah, you may have kind of healed from this. This could have been something that was just toxic. Or there could have been something there like some type of healing and recovery happened. Show me, um, or quiet time. Show me this four of pentacles for Taurus for the current energies. The hermit and the page of cups. So it looks like, I mean, there's not a lot of movement there, but this will open back up again. We have a decision that's coming. So while it may not have been moving right now, there may have been kind of like a quiet time, especially with the hermit there. Somebody's been, yeah, the seven of wands. This is a pretty guarded energy, but someone who's kind of going within. So, like, if you are dealing with a water sign or a cancer, and then that, that Virgo energy there, that's kind of like an inward energy. So, it feels like somebody may have pulled back a little bit, but the feelings aren't there. I mean, are still there. They're just not sure how to express it. Things are kind of stuck at a standstill, which, again, you have all kinds of twos. So, 
Um, but right now, the current two is the two of swords. It's stuck. Show me this near the immediate future, please. The seven of Pentacles. Now somebody is like, um, it really feels like trying to get the ball rolling. You have the seven of Pentacles, which is making an investment, like um, planning seeds, putting time and energy into this. They're coming at it from a very logical standpoint. So, so give me one more for the immediate future outcome, please. The High Priestess and the Ace of Swords. Yeah, clarity is coming. Communication, answers. Some things that have to be figured out. And it doesn't feel like, though, when somebody kind of approaches a situation, like they come all the way out with their feelings. So right now where things are kind of, uh, this can be even stuck intuitively. Like somebody is, is getting that clarity. And it feels like they want to get something off their chest. But the High Priestess and the Ace of Swords is things that we keep in. Um, but for some, this, this was, you know, there was like a, uh, something kept going on repeat here, but it still feels like something's kind of still up in the air, but it's more, it's some type of insight that's coming. Can I have messages? I wonder if you are happy without me. I definitely still thinking about you. I love you. One more for Taurus, please. I hope that one day you can forgive me and I will wait for a sign from you. They may be really nervous to reach out and contact you. All right, Taurus, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care, and I will see you next time.